Hey, hey everyone. How is everyone quarantine going so far? I hope you guys are having a spectacular time. Um, at this particular point, you just we just got to get with the flow, right? There's nothing we can do. Um, we just have to get with the flow. Don't mind my pimple. I know, I know. I hate it. Oh, um, somebody needs to teach me how to get rid of a pimple just before a video. Just before making a video. Hello. But nonetheless, um, at this point, in terms of quarantine, it is what it is. It is what it is. We just got to go with the flow, obviously adjust as we can, and just be hopeful for the future. And so um, I'm happy you guys are joining me on my channel. If you don't know, now you know. My name is Kamisha, CEO and founder of EBK Events, this beautiful company that I started five, six years ago, but who's counting? Um, EBK Events is a mission-focused strategic event planning firm right here in the beautiful New York City. And we plan events that are strategic, that are really empowering from fashion shows with a cause to nonprofit events um, to social gatherings. Many of you may have saw something online or whatever the case may be and it drew you to our channel. So we do a bunch of um, different types of events for our clients um, so again welcome to my channel um, this is something new that we are doing just to engage with our audience across all our social media and of course just to provide some content uh, for you so I'm hoping that this provides some type of content and I'm hoping that even in isolation that we are all experiencing across the globe, um, this can bring you closer to your family, it can bring you closer to your loved ones, and even the ideas that I'm about to provide you with now, which are only five tips, um, but you can also incorporate them into other, um, you know, other fun things that you can do for other loved ones besides your mother. Ah, yes, you guessed it. Five tips to five tips to surprise mom this weekend or to surprise mom during quarantine. So it doesn't have to be this weekend, but five tips you can do um, to surprise mom during quarantine. So this was dedicated to Mother's Day, of course, and we still celebrating Mother's Day. Yes, it passed, but we still celebrating mothers because mothers, we know that if it wasn't for them, we wouldn't be here. Exactly. So all month long, we are going to celebrate our mothers. We're going to celebrate those important women in our lives, those women that make us shine, those women that makes makes us wake up in the morning because they love us so much and they've sacrificed so much for us. So five tips to surprise your mother while in quarantine. First tip, host mom to a breakfast in bed. Yes, honey, we all love breakfast in bed. This item never gets old, but maybe put a little twist on it. Uh, so this weekend, or when you are home with mom, you can prepare breakfast and maybe cut out some really cool pictures of places and trips you both travel to. Um, and you basically surprise her with that during quarantine. Now listen, this is so nostalgic because here's what. While you're providing her with something as mundane as breakfast in bed. Because I'm, I'm, I'm pretty sure mom hasn't missed a meal, right? Come on now. We don't miss meals. Um, but at the end of the day, it's not about the meal. It's about the sentiment and creating that aura, right? So... You might want to uh, create a collage and just basically provide like different um, pictures. You know, different. You can upload. Be, there are so many different um, uh, platforms and different services that you can use online to create a collage. But you want to create a really nice, adventurous collage with different things that mom have attended with you. Different highlights, adventures, um, whatever um, celebratory events. You want to create a nice collage and surprise her with with that. Both of you, as you're eating breakfast as she's eating breakfast you can reminisce on a good old time and that leads into gratitude she will remember mom will remember those beautiful adventures before quarantine right before isolation she would remember those beautiful times spent together and those memories created so host mom to a beautiful breakfast in bed with a little twist all right second host mom to a pristine dinner pristine dinner on the porch or in the living room maybe have her dress up a little like moi dress up a little and take some really cute photos together 
When developing the prints, make sure you use a template that reads, Happy Mother's Day, or I love your mom. Again, we have passed Mother's Day, but it's still about celebrating. It's still about showing your mom affection and love and appreciation. And again, these ideas can be used on your loved one, on your partner. So it's just about incorporating. So when you are creating that moment, you may want to take some beautiful pictures and you get a template that reads, I love you. And this is why I love you. You know what I'm saying? Something creative, something adventurous, right? Don't make quarantine boring. No, no, we are not making quarantine boring. Honey, we are not. We are alive. We are in our right minds. I'm hoping that you are in your right mind. So we're going to make the best of this and we're going to come out on top. Okay? All right. So you're going to host mom to a really nice dinner and something elaborate, something really nice. It doesn't have to be over the top, but something really meaningful. Some, uh, Maybe even create a dish that she loves, that she's been craving for. Surprise her with that. Right? Exactly. Spontaneous. Be spontaneous. Okay? All right. Third, take your mom for a nature walk or a picnic at the park. Now I know every state has different mandates when it comes to going out and how long we can stay outside and so forth. We all know we have to be safe. So whatever state you're in, whatever country, it's all about being safe. We know what's taking place right now in our world. There's a virus. And even though we are um, maybe at the peak where it's actually decreasing, in terms of casualty, like for example, I'm in New York City, and so there is, um, you know, a peak, and of course it's declining. Um, but in any event, there is a virus. There is something that we are being told to be careful, um, and so that, that that's what we're going to do. But we are not going to be afraid. So we are going to be cautious, but we're not going to be afraid, right? So take mom for a picnic walk in the park. Of course, have your mask on, have your precautions um, available to you, and just have a really good time. Go for a nature walk at the nearest park. Look at the birds, look at the pond. Just enjoy nature in its finest, right? Enjoy nature. So definitely, that's the third one. The fourth one is, ooh, wait for it now, wait for it. Bake mom a delicious cake. Yummy. Bake mom a delicious cake. You know, something that she loves, right? Make her... Make her um, enjoy that cake. When she is eating that cake, she has a nostalgic experience. Like it, 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 it brings back something to her memory, right? Her childhood. For example, my mother, for Mother's Day that passed, what I did is I baked. Uh, well, actually, I didn't bake. Y'all know I did not bake, honey. Okay. Oh, I know my talents. Baking is not one. <laughs> I actually um, contacted a local uh, merchant here, a local um uh, caterer and she uh, baked a beautiful cake and this cake is actually a rum cake uh, my mother's Caribbean so she loves that you know that um that feeling of the Caribbean and so forth and obviously we're not in the Caribbean so um, I baked her a rum cake well I paid for the rum cake to be baked and it was so beautiful she loved it she was like mm -mm. Because it, it brings back a feeling of, you know, her culture, her roots. So you want to, you know, whatever you're doing, you have to invest. You have to know your mother. You have to know your partner so that you really can bring out the best in the, in, in them um, while you're creating an experience, right? That's It's all about creating an experience, right? So bake mom a cake and something that she really really loves and it doesn't have to be again cake um it can also be a dish creating something that she absolutely loves matter of fact i can even interject here because this is the fourth one while you're having this amazing time with your loved one or with your mother if she likes the garden, take her out to the garden. If you live in the inner city communities and there isn't much gardening taking place, maybe you live in an apartment complex, buy some flowers, right? Buy some flowers, some fresh flowers, and, and bring it home. Um, we all know flowers in apartments um, assist with the oxygen and the oxygen flow. So, you know, do more. Go go above and beyond. Go above and beyond. And even while you're in the park and you, you know, you're know you taking a nature walk, you know, talk to mom about some of the flowers. Name some of those flowers and just reminisce on those good old times, right? So, that's a really good idea. The fifth one is host mom, which I absolutely love. Remember guys, five things, five events or five planning ideas that you can do to surprise mom or your partner or your partner while in isolation. So these again are just five planning, really quick 
planning ideas or hacks as they say H A C K hacks that you can do just to stay active obviously to continue that experience to share that experience and obviously to show mom that you love her or show your partner that you love them despite of because the troubles honey they're gonna be there when you come back they're gonna be there when you leave so we ain't even gonna worry about the troubles let's enjoy the moment let's celebrate each other and let's really honor each other while we have the opportunity to so the fifth and the final one in terms of hosting mom or your partner remember doesn't have to be a mother just someone that you love so you're going to create um or, or curate a virtual event like a virtual party right and um it's not going to be like the regular virtual parties. Maybe this time you can ensure that the family members or the loved ones get together. And before they come online, before they get on the virtual party, let them write some beautiful love notes. Let them write something that um, their experience with, with, with mom or the loved one that you're celebrating, right? What is their experience? So, for example, you might have your niece. Your niece has a different experience than you right or you might have your dad your dad may have a different experience than you know um uncle right or mom's husband might have a different experience than you so just have you know these family members partake and just write in their experience what what they love right what they um admire about that loved one and just have a great time kicking laughing having fun on this virtual party you can use zoom you can use go to webinar go to meetings you can use so many different platforms that they have online um, that you guys can use um, at your disposal so you can definitely look that up and if you would like to know more you can look at my next my second video my first video in reference to how to plan virtual um, events so guys that is it that is it five tips in terms of celebrating your partner, in terms of celebrating your loved one that you can do while in quarantine, five planning tips. Number one, you can host them to breakfast in bed, all right? You can provide or you can create a beautiful atmosphere, whether it be dinner, on the porch, outside, on the living room, wherever you call home. Just make it beautiful, make it you, and make it an experience. And then, of course, uh, you can go for a nature walk. You can go for a nice little run in the, in the park. And then, of course, bake or cook. But this is really important. You want to bake something. You really want to take your time and invest in something. And if you can't bake, that's fine. They got people for that. We got to support small businesses. Okay? Exactly. So make sure you contact your local bakery that your mom absolutely loves. She may be an essential worker and is working super hard and never really got a chance to, you know, um, get one, you know, pick up one of her beautiful cakes. So you surprise her with that. And the fifth and last one is to host a virtual get together with your family. Um, with family members or loved ones and let them tell their stories let them tell their experience with mom or your loved one guys that's it tonight my name is Kamisha Superville I am the CEO and founder of EBK events and I am hoping that you contact us if you like any ideas pertaining to event planning. If you'd like to work with us, partner, um, be a sponsor for one of our events, definitely reach out to us. Our email is ebkeventsllc at gmail. Very simple. EBK events with an s llc at gmail i look forward to hearing from you guys you have a great time be positive we are praying for those that have lost their life to this horrible virus guys the only way we're going to come on the other side of this is by continuing to be motivated continue to support one another and continue to love on one another it's your girl kamisha have a great night stay home stay safe bye guys